Guys, you guys wanted to say hi to Pimp. A lot of you did. He's doing great. And we got some severe thunderstorms in the area, so I'm going to go out and record. Oh, look, he's, he's, he's sticking his hand out to say hi to you guys. Yes, my boy. Yes, my boy. Oh, yes. All right, guys. So I am out of here. We're going to go to some, some weather videos. Woohoo! What is up, everybody? It's Saturday, July 30th in Big Bear Lake, California. And we are getting some thunderstorms again. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing Pimp. For those of you who don't know, Pimp's my cat, and a lot of you have been asking to see him, so I want to show you guys a little 10, 15 second clip before this, you probably saw it. Hopefully you guys didn't click off, because I want you guys to see, it's nasty out here right now. I mean, it is horrible out here. It hasn't started coming down like it's supposed to yet, but this is as dark as I've seen it up here in a long time. Even the other day when we had those crazy thunderstorms, it, it, it wasn't like this. I mean, there's layers of clouds, like layers and layers of thick cumulus and cumulonimbus clouds. It's really, 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 really gorgeous. I am so blessed to live here. So blessed. Wow. Okay, so we're headed towards Big Bear Lake, but we're gonna turn around because the main part of the storm is over here to the south. Or the east. The east. Oh. That person was nice, they let me, they let me come true, they let me come true, it's a come true, they let me come true. Alright, so, yes, marriage is going great, I'm with a wonderful woman, um, she deserves to be loved as much as any woman could possibly be loved, just a special person, and I can't wait to introduce you guys to her, she's a bit shy, so, um, when it comes to this stuff, but I want to make sure that I can do what I can to introduce you guys to her. I appreciate you guys a lot. And thank you guys for all the love and support and all the beautiful comments you give me about this. Like, like you guys are you guys are literally the best in my life. You guys are so awesome and you guys make me feel so good about myself. You guys remember like nine months ago, I was so depressed, like in, in the hospital because of panic attacks. Like I've never had them before, but now I'm like total opposite. So guys, it can happen. You can become happy again, I'm telling you use me as the perfect example so anyway we are starting to get some drizzle I mean look at these clouds over here over like by Bear Mountain and stuff it's just thick over there you can't get a good sensation through this camera however however we're gonna do the best we can okay so this is Sugarloaf Boulevard you guys this is the boulevard I take often which kind of cuts through from, uh, from the, it, it cuts through most of Big Bear City. It's a straight route. You don't have to make any turns. You can basically get all the way from one side of Big Bear City to the other without having to make any turns. That's why I like to take Sugarloaf Boulevard. Yeah, look at these clouds up there. It's so beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. And here, look at that. Hear that thunder? Sorry about so, that. Awesome. Yeah. But these clouds are looking pretty intense right now. Um, it doesn't seem like it came together the way it was anticipated the past few days. We were, it, it, I was under the assumption that we were literally going to get like such severe storms that we're going to have to tie our like lawn furniture down type stuff. Nothing like that yet, but all it takes is just one of these storms to come blowing through. Um, but yeah, I'm glad I can bring this to you guys. I love you guys so much. I apologize also about not getting like right back to you guys recently since I've been married. I'm... I don't love you guys any less. Like, uh, we've been doing a honeymoon where we stay in a hotel for like two or three nights per week, but it has to be in Big Bear because of my business. I can't, I can't leave town. So we've been staying in hotels two, two to three nights per week to do kind of like an extended honeymoon, you could say. So we're probably for the next month or two, we'll probably keep on doing that and just going and staying at a, a different place. I actually made a video of the lakefront lodge it was one of the last ones we stayed at because i've never stayed there before and i want to stay everywhere up here to show you guys so i will upload that as well in a couple days i don't think it's the best video i think i kind of rushed it a little bit but i hope you guys enjoy it i'm sure it'll give you guys the gist of what that place is about the best part is it's right on the lake well since the lake is so low it's about 100 yards from the lake now it's crazy how far out you have to go but yeah, do you guys hear that? 
Hang on, that's my mommy calling. Yeah, it's my mommy calling. Okay, so we had an officer of the law behind us, so I didn't want to be using my phone. So now we're on Highway 38. We're gonna go into Irwin Lake, Irwin area. Guys, this is incredible. I mean, I don't know why I get so excited about nothing, but this is incredible to me. Okay, so this is Irwin. This is like the second to last neighborhood before you literally leave town. The next one up is Lake Williams. It's like two or three miles up here on the left-hand side, but this is basically as far as you go in Big Bear to one direction. This is it. You either left or right here into these two neighborhoods, and that's it. But uh, yeah, look at those clouds, unbelievable. All right, so I think we're gonna turn around here and start heading back. I'm hoping that on our drive back, we're able to get through um, or come up on this storm as it's building. That's what I'm hoping. Alright you guys, so we're coming back out of Irwin. Look at these clouds. I mean these just insanity. I mean, oh my gosh, these clouds are blowing up right here. When we get past this little area, you should be able to tell. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm married. I do know that. I feel like such a little kid right now. I am so excited. And this person loves me so much, like you guys don't even understand. I've been engaged twice before in my in my young life. And thankfully those never worked out. But like I just I just I've never been loved the way that this person loves me. I really want to do everything I can for her. And I really hope that all of you have have something similar in your lives too. I just can't believe what's happening in my life. I did not expect this to happen. I'm so focused on working hard, making money, helping my mom and dad out and stuff, and making YouTube videos. Um, I, I, I kind of accepted that I'm, I'm just I'm just gonna not be an unmarried man. Like I, I got to that point where I'm in my 40s now, so I was like, I'm not gonna get married. Like, what a waste of life. But now not only am I gonna get married, but she wants to give me children too, so. I'm very happy, I'm very happy. Sorry for talking about that so much, you guys, but I love you guys so much, and I miss you guys. It's been a long time since I've had any conversations with you guys. You guys are my Dr. Phil, I promise. You guys really are, and I love talking to you guys about everything that's going on in my life. Right. Man, it's just so pretty. Hang on a moment. Okay, just look at these. Look how thick those are. We're going to get lightning right from there, I guarantee you. I guarantee you. Oh, make, oh shit, I didn't mean to run it. I really didn't. I really didn't. I was like in between braking right there. I really didn't mean to do that. I apologize, you guys. Dang it, I hope no one saw that. This camera has a two second delay and it makes it look like it's red, but it's actually green. So we are headed back into the hellish storm. Just give me a moment. Okay. Seriously, guys, this is so unbelievably beautiful, but we're not getting much out of this. My phone's gonna overheat. It's unbelievable. These are like, this is the type of cloud cover that you get when you get really good scattered severe thunderstorms. It's just, it's just one storm after the other connecting. It's just, it's so beautiful. Wow, on that side of the mountain range, it looks really scary. Wow, look at that. Oh my gosh. But yeah, I'm telling you guys, I'm so happy. I'm so happy right now. And yeah, we got married super quick. We certainly did. But like, we're honorable.
of people. And yes, I was talking to her for a while because I really, really liked her, but she was seeing somebody and we're just not those type of people to like hurt anybody like that. Like I, I, I just couldn't do that and I wouldn't do that. Um, and it was just so nice how, how respectful and loving she was about the whole situation because you know, it's, 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 it's just a beautiful thing to have a woman with such dignity like that. Like we could have been making out and doing things and stuff like that. And no, nothing ever happened. Like nothing ever happened until she was broken up with the guy and then we got together and then we got married super quick. But you know what? Like I'm 42 years old. I'm so happy with this woman. She's so happy with me. And uh, yeah, I have a very honorable person. Like she is, she is so honorable. I used to worry in my last relationships about being cheated on and stuff, like minor jealousy stuff, right? It's not nearly as bad with her because of how she treated our situation when we first started talking. We were talking for months, like every day on the phone, talking for months. Um, and she had been trying for the past year prior to even meeting me to get out of that relationship. She said the guy's a nice guy. It's just she's not getting what she wants out of it and and I saw a beautiful perfect woman and I said I'll give it to you and I'm not perfect either no one's perfect but I'm trying my best and she deserves the best and I'm so sorry to keep on talking about this like I feel like such a tool this is a weather channel this isn't like a love story channel but um, yeah I'm just so grateful I am so grateful I know some of you had some some questions also like because I talked about the whole situation in plenty of my videos but I just wanted you guys to know the type of person I am and the type of person that my wife is like it's just hurting people is not what we're about and literally like once we officially got together that's when things you know holding hands and stuff like that started happening but it's just, it, it's, I am so blessed to be with such an amazing woman and she is so beautiful, you guys. I don't, I don't know what she thinks is so hot about this guy. You know, like, I don't get it, but it is what it is. I mean, she's way out of my league, you guys. When you see her, you guys are gonna think I paid her to like be in the video. <laughs> I'm telling you, she is so unbelievably gorgeous. So smart. She's starting her own business this winter time. Um, I'm looking forward to helping her get that started, even though she doesn't need me for that, but I'm her husband. Anyway, that's it. Done. Done. Kaput. I love you guys. Thank you for listening to my, to my damn stories about life and love recently, which is so beautiful. I'm so glad I can chat about love with you guys because it's always been like, not always, but just sad stuff for me, depression and the past couple of years. It's been really hard for me. I could be in a room full of people and feel all alone. And she's completely changed out for me. Anyway, you guys, thank you for everything once again. All the love you guys show me. I really can't stress to you enough how much that means to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Keep your eye peeled right there. There's going to be lightning right there. I promise. I promise. I promise. I hope. And not that I've seen any lightning bolts yet, but that, that looks like the... Like, it, that just looks like the type of cloud that is going to give off some good lightning. Drive car, everybody get together and try and drive a little better right now. Oh, hey, there's stator brothers. Hey. <laughs> okay, there's Snow Summit. But yeah, the clouds that I'm saying where it looks like we're going to get some lightning is right around pointing right there. To the right, okay, you see Snow Summit right there, this is the ski resort. According to the video, look about five inches to the right. <laughs> and that's where we're going to get some good lightning, I guarantee you. Any of this can definitely produce lightning, but over there, that's gonna be our best best option. So I'm gonna keep this looking over there. I'm not gonna look over there though, so if there's any lightning, I'm not gonna see it. Hopefully you guys do. Oh, look at that cloud right there, man. Oh my 
goodness, it's a scary cloud. What am I going to do? Can't believe we're doing this. And I am so excited because I got my wife at her house the fastest internet available because of my videos and stuff. So, um, literally at her house, it took me to do the other day's video. It was, I don't know, I think it was like a 10 minute video or something like that. Not long. It took hours and hours and hours. That video on my Wi-Fi and on the one she has now, that 10 minute video will take about 15 minutes to fully upload, to process and everything. It's just incredible. It uploads at, at like 50, 50 megabytes, I think. And it's a one, one, one gig download speed. But the upload speed's phenomenal. Anyway, we're headed back into Moon Ridge right now. I thought I'd give you guys just the, the kind of small tour of this part of town that is going to be getting hammered. But my gosh, it looks like we went to the wrong side of town. Usually it's not this side of town I'm pointing at that gets hit the hardest with these storms. But these clouds are not messing around. Not at all. You guys didn't see my hand gesture right there. You guys would have been very disappointed in me. Anyway, guys, thank you for everything. I can't ever thank you guys enough for all the love you show me and all the respect you show me. I don't know if I would even still be here. I have to, I, I've told you guys this for years. You guys have done so much for me emotionally. I was going through some hard times and you guys have saved me. You literally have saved me. So I love each and every single one of you with all my heart. And thank you again for everything you do for me from the bottom of my heart whatever i can do for you guys please please let me know like and i'm sorry once again about the late responses but i love you guys it's july 30th 2022 Bye, you okay guys. you guys i thought i was i thought i was going to be done with that video but i'm not not at all i am actually getting some raindrops now with these massive clouds and you guys know what we do, so I didn't want to make two videos today. This isn't the winter time when making all the videos isn't a big deal. I just hate doing that. All right, let's see here. Come on, cars. Come on, cars. Let me get out of here. Let me get out of here. Out of here. OJ's Donuts is a phenomenal place. I like it. There's quite a few options. There's like three or four different donut shops up here. Look, you can see it's raining really hard by Snow Summit right there over by my house but yeah we just got some drops here so of course I'm gonna show you guys what's happening in this in this place called Big Bear I hope the video is not too annoying um, but yeah I love you guys a lot can't stop saying that I never will um, thank you guys for being there for me always so unfortunately this is gonna be it I think for real I was about to curse. Man, I've been having some really, I've been, my my mouth has been really bad lately. Man, look at that cloud way over the, way over the mountain up there. Man, this is so beautiful, you guys. Holy criminy. All right. Anyway, I know you guys are getting sick of this video, but it's beautiful up here. And this is what I do. This YouTube channel is for fun and for sanity for me, you know? For those of you who think this is my job, this is not my job. I, I own a business up here. I work about 70 to 80, sometimes 90 hours a week. All by myself, seven days a week. Anyway, we're off. We are off like a prom dress. I love you guys. I will talk to you guys later. And that's my wife texting me right now. <laughs> I'm so happy. You guys are gonna think I'm the biggest dork now. I totally know it, but that's okay. I love you guys. Take care. Wow, it's so beautiful! Oh my god! It's so beautiful! Peace out, you guys.